Hi all, so in this video I'm going to show you how to do this kind of crazy curl noisy type thing with um, with Maya 2018 and the new curl noise in uh, the Maya signal node, so mash signal node. Uh, right, so let's get started. I have the content browser here. I am going to import a head from the content browser. It is massive. I'm going to shrink that down. And then I am going to create a mesh network. So let's just do that. And then we'll change the distribution type to mesh and then drag in the basic head into the input mesh there. And then we'll put on 100 or points. No, let's put on 200 for now. And there are points. And then what we'll do is we will add a signal node. So we'll just add a signal node. And then um, I will change the signal type to curl noise. And then if I just push play, you've got this kind of stuff going on, whatever. Um, so uh, the first thing I want to do is add some trails. So if I just add trails, um, uh, I can actually turn off the head now. If I add trails and then... If I push play, uh, nothing's moving fast enough to kind of like uh, create anything interesting here. Um, so by default, the signal is set to have five in the y axis and then one in the x and z. So let's just swap that around actually. Let's do five, or well, let's just zero and y, five and z. So if I now show this, you can see from the top down, we've kind of got this going on. Now um, I'm just going to. Um, uh, double up the frequency and you see it's not like nothing massively interesting is happening oh wait time scale that's what i want to do uh, nothing really that interesting is going on and um, you can't really tell that it is a head. Uh, so what we want to do is instead of having the noise happen in world space, we want to have it, have it happen in local space. Because if you remember, our cubes are all facing out of the um, mesh normals, which is the default for um, mesh. So you can actually have uh, the noise happen in that local space there as if uh, um, it was taking the uh, rotation from that, um, uh, from that normal. So uh, let's just change this space to local and then and if we, I'm just going to uh, play a few frames back, and then what I'm going to do is add a material to this. So if I just add a new material, and we'll do whatever, it doesn't matter really. Um, make it kind of glowy. Um, let's pick that color, and then, okay. So back on the signal node, um, I'm going to uh, really speed up the time. So uh, we get, okay, so that's much better. Um, okay, so first things first, um, on my trails node, the maximum trails count will be set to uh, 100, and I have 200 mash points, so let's just increase that. So here are our 200 trails, and um, I think the noise is probably a little bit too big, so let's maybe set that to 3. Okay, and then I don't think that uh, 200 is enough, so let's say we want 400, and then let's have 400 maximum trails the length of 15 so we get something more like this which is more like the effect that I was after before I think there were a thousand trails in the one that I um, play blasted um, so there are a few things that you can play with to make interesting effects here so um, other than the fact that you can mess around with the time scale here uh, something else you can mess around with is a step so if you set you do need a, a step for um, um, curl noise but if you can set a step like a really really tiny one like 0.01 um, you'll see that um, you end up having things like almost grouped together as if they were flowing uh, in a kind of um, almost fluid way. It's kind of one of the things that um, curl noise is used to fake is um, fluid-like effects. So um, if I actually just up the number of trails again. So you can see more of the effect there. So that's the kind of effect that um, uh, this would have if you had it in um, uh, so local mode and then uh, no up and down movement. So it's not going at, uh, along the normal. It's not moving along the normal, which is what Y would do. I mean, we could we could add that if we wanted to, but it kind of makes it a lot more kind of hairy and um, difficult to see what's going on, which might be the effect that you're after, to be honest. If you had enough of them, you'd still be able to tell what was going on. Like if uh, this was just, yeah, so if you had something more like this, um, anyway, uh, so let's set this back to what it was. 
and uh, if we increase the steps slightly and then um, like I had in the um, in the play blast if we set everything to a thousand and then a thousand trails um, and then we play back Ooh, not a hundred a thousand It. <laughs> uh, there you go, and that's the kind of the final effect. If I just change the background color here, Alt B. There you go, and so yeah, that's my kind of like curl noisy typey hologram effect. <laughs> so, um, and that is the new kind of curl noise that you get in um, um, twenty eighteen. Uh, in mash so there you go uh, another weird effect um it's just, it's fun just have a play <laughs>